Hello there, Trevor here from Double Bill Movies. Hope you're all having a lovely weekend. Uh, I've been on a bit of a shopping spree. <laughs> so, got a little haul for you. Um, just from CEX. A while ago, I took a load of stuff in, um, a lot of steel books and things, and I managed to acquire quite a bit of store credit. So, um, popping there today, I was not particularly expecting to get quite what I did, but um, and actually a friend of mine popped in and uh, we were standing there talking and he looked at the top shelf and went, I was in the other day and I swear that shelf was full. And he looked at my hand. <laughs> I had it all in my hand. So, <clears throat> now this first title you're going to think, why the hell have you got that drift? That's on 4K and you've got it on 4K. <clears throat> I bought Heat on DVD. Now there's a reason for this. I'm planning a video on the Blu-ray format. And um, I need a DVD, a Blu-ray and a 4K to be, do a bit of a demonstration. Um, so it wasn't very much. It's very possible this is the version I got rid of. Doesn't matter. <laughs> anyway, heat on DVD. <clears throat> this next one, you may also realise that I already have. And it is the Digibook of Gone Girl. Um, but this one has the book in it which the other one doesn't. So um, I'm going to work out which of the outer bits is the best and then I'll just get rid of, I mean, they've both got discs in. Um, so I'll just get rid of that to a charity shop or something. Um, right, then the best part. <coughs> Despicable Me, 4K. And um, definitely seen this one, but I have not sure I've seen the other two. Uh, we have seen Minions, um, which I did pop to HMV to try and get, but they didn't have any. Uh, so Despicable Me, Despicable Me 2 on 4K with a lovely slip. And yes, you guessed it, Despicable Me 3 on 4K with a lovely slip. Uh, this was a great top shelf. Um, now this one, is a bit lucky. It is Passengers on 4K, but this has the 3D version in it as well. That's because it's the American SKU. Now, usually CEX do not take foreign SKUs, um, but as we were sorting these out, my wife noticed the gap in the slip cover. And when I looked it up on Blu-ray.com to add it to my collection, there, lo and behold, it was the American version. Um, so now I can get rid of my Blu-ray 3D steelbook um, because I have not only the 3D but the 4K. Um, great film that, saw it in the cinema. <coughs> now, um, I'm not entirely sure I've seen this uncut version. Uh, I may be wrong, but um, the Blu-rays of these particular films have quite a lot of what we call black crush. Um, so basically there's no detail in the dark areas. Um, so essentially you get very little sort of, you can really see on screen um, and no amount of turning up to brightness will make any difference. So I'm hoping this has been rectified on these 4Ks and it is Expendables, uncut version. Um, again, with a slip. So, of course, the next one is Expendables 2, or as I like to call them, the Expandables. <laughs> um, got the slip, and as you can see, I managed to get all the stickers off, um, and they peeled off really nicely. I didn't have to use lighter fluid on any of them. Um, so hopefully, they've been listening to us, CEX, and have improved the uh, adhesive on the stickers. Sadly, um, whoever brought these 4Ks into CEX didn't appear to have Expendables 3 or someone had already come and purchased it. Um, so the next title I managed to pick up was The Equalizer with Denzel of Washington. Um, really good film this. Um, I think he plays the part really well and uh, just again shows his diversity as an actor. And of course, you've got to have Equalizer too, haven't you? Now, 
pretty sure I haven't seen this one. Um, pretty sure I don't have it on Blu-ray. Um, so essentially, this one and po probably um, Despicable Me 2 and 3 are the only additions to the collection. Everything else I've already got, so there'll be Blu-rays that I'll be passing on. Um, so there you go. Just a quick little haul video for you. Um, yes, and if you're intrigued by my uh, discussion about Blu-ray, um, then keep your eyes and ears out. Make sure you set your notifications if you subscribe to my channel um, to all, so that you don't miss out when I put out this video. Um, got quite a bit more compiling to do before I just, I didn't want to just sit down and talk about it and say, hey, this is happening and not have any proof to show you. Um, so I'm just working on that part at the moment. And uh, so if you like this little haul video, give it a thumbs up. Um, like I said, subscribe to the channel and um, I'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.